Fox 6 News at 6 continues with Brad Nix, Ann State, Chief Meteorologist Vince Condella, and Tim Van Voren Sports. Fox 6 News, because you matter. Jackie Robinson changed baseball forever, and his story is told in that new movie, 42. It's a pretty good one, too. I've seen it. Fox 6's Brett Bogansky was at a private showing today featuring, get this, Jackie Robinson's own daughter and the commissioner of baseball. It's a private screening at the Marcus North Shore Cinema. The crowd mostly students from Milwaukee's Roosevelt Middle School. Seeing the powerful biographical film of the first African American Major League Baseball player. I hope to your generation, to all of you, you'll all you'll you'll begin to understand what Jackie Robinson meant. Major League Baseball Commissioner Bud Seeley calls it the most important and powerful moment in baseball history. Pressure on Jackie to succeed was mind-boggling to me, even in retrospect. Selig said it was Robinson who paved the way for men who would become baseball legends. Henry Aaron, who became famous in Milwaukee, Willie Mays, Bob Gibson. You see that Jackie Robinson was a great athlete, right? But you see more than that, don't you? Robinson's daughter Sharon explains the movie is about more than baseball, but also how her father's relationship with Branch Rickey and his wife Rachel helped him persevere through great adversity. Integrity is an important value for you to develop during these middle years because you're going to need it even more when you get into high school. Sharon Robinson explained to students why this film is an important learning tool about succeeding not only in baseball, but in life. You got to do what you think is right. And if it isn't popular, so be it. Just go do it. And during times of struggles, standing up for what you think is right. Well, Bud Selig and Sharon Robinson said they wouldn't change anything about the movie. They said the filmmakers did a remarkable job following Robinson's first season of 1947. Ted, and back to you. All right, Brad, thank you. Whether he's hitting the football field or the dance floor,